Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I actually have a Sephora haul and a hygiene haul today. So yes, I hope you guys enjoyed my last few hauls. I've been hauling a lot, but I purchased all on Monday, which is crazy. But yes, um, I mean like all my hauling stuff recently, wall flowers and the outlet stuff and this, and the stuff in here I didn't purchase all in one day. But yes, I did go to the Sephora sale. I could not partake in it because the brand I chose to purchase from is not really part of the, any sales. So yeah, we'll get to that later, but first I'm going to go to the thing on top, and this is the Bubble Slam Dunk Hydrating Moisturizer. I love this stuff. Like, this stuff is one fluid ounce or 30 milliliters, and it's only $5 on clearance at Walmart right now. Um, I believe, I don't know if it's still online because I went in store, a different store, and it wasn't, but there's this. I've been using my one for maybe about almost two weeks now. And I really haven't put a huge dent in it. I definitely, I do like one squirt at the top because it is, it is a kind of squirter where it comes at the top and makes a little flower kind of thing and you take it out. I usually do one, put all my serums and stuff on and then do the other one. So yeah, I do absolutely love this and I am very excited to have this. So I do like the cleanser as well, but I thought the moisturizer was probably more of a better deal since it doesn't rip me out. It moisturizes my skin so much to the point that my skin doesn't even get oily and it's great. Um, so I love this so much. Okay, and next I have three wax melts. The first one is a new um, Better Homes and Gardens Christmassy scent. This is the White Peppermint and Mocha scent. The notes are peppermint, coffee, sugarcane, froth milk, whipped cream, and candy cane. That's what it looks like. I've already broken the cubes up, but you definitely smell it. And it smells kind of interesting at first because it smells like minty mouthwash. But that's because of that weird coffee note. But once you sit here and smell it, you get the mint. The coffee, the candy cane, the soft, creamy marshmallowiness. Yeah, it smells really good. Um, I, it smells really awkward and weird. We first smell it when you sit there and take it all in. It does smell really good. And I'm very excited to have that to melt this Christmas Eve season. I also picked up two of the mainstays, Little Baby Wax Melts. Um, these are usually like a dollar or 99 cents. I picked up the Apple Cider Donut Wax Melts. Um, yeah, these are half the size of the other ones, but they're so much stronger. That's what it looks like. Um, yes. On the top, I definitely get the, um, like, donut part, but on the bottom, I get way more of the apple, and in my opinion, these are not super, like, donut -y. They're definitely more of cider apple fresh with a hint of bakery, so if you like more apple, less bakery, you definitely get that. I also picked up the apple... Wait, did this have notes? No. Um, the apple fritters wax melts. These have notes. Um, it's apple, maple, and vanilla. Very complex. <laughs> um, but yes. That's what they look like, and I'm definitely getting a high potpourri content smell of this. But I sit and smell it again. I'm definitely getting a hint of bakery, lots of spice, lots of like a dark apple. Now on the bottom, I definitely get more of the bakery kind of really good smell. And yeah, I do think I'll really enjoy this. Um, I don't know if I'll use it this year or next year around fall, but yeah. Okay, the next thing I got is a native deodorant. I love the native deodorants. Um, I didn't start my natural deodorant, aluminum free deodorant journey with them, but I've been continuing with them and I really do like them. So I picked up the cotton and cedarwood um, native deodorant. This is paraben free and aluminum free. This is regular kind and not the sensitive kind. Um, but yeah, this definitely has a slightly cologne manly smell, but it is very fresh and clean as well. And a hint of like woodsy, woodsy like softness and I really do like it um these are 2.65 ounces and they are $13 I got this at walmart.com they don't have like the good scents um online yet but hopefully I'll be able to find it soon since people have been finding them in stores okay the last thing I got is actually the thing for my little Sephora haul and I went there and I had known that the Ordinary which is the brand I purchased is not part of the 10% off sale which is what I would have gotten because I like never ever shop there and I'm very thankful actually that they carry the Ordinary because um, like the Ulta we have is like really far away um, and I just don't like it that much. Anyways, I like Sephora better. And yes, I have this. I got the Glycolic Acid 7% Toning Solution. Um, yes, this has new packaging. It used to have like the little squirty bottle top. Um, this is an opening. Come on. It used to have like the little squirt top, but um, wait, no, it does. It does have the squirt top. You can just put it on if you want. Um, this is what it looks like inside, and yeah, this is what it looks like. This is the Glycol Acid 7% Toning Solution. So basically, I got this to use on my underarms, 
because a lot of people says that's really good to use because um it flakes and takes away um odor which is really good when you're transitioning from different like aluminum free deodorants to deodorants because there is a little transition period between deodorant brands i found um yeah and basically i'm really um happy to use this i'll probably use this um on my face as well just because i need some exfoliation but yeah it comes with a little top and i'm very excited to have this is one ten dollars and it stayed ten dollars because it was not necessarily on sale so yeah thank you guys all so much for watching um i hope um like like i'm in fragment stuff but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and see you later bye